this is not a competition to, you know, to build fighters or make pro fighters. You know, this is a competition to help build a set of skill sets uh, that the Army needs to instill in every soldier. A combative tournament is just a training tool that we utilize. It, you know, it's, a, it's similar to a live practical application. It's like we have NTC and we have all these other field exercises that we utilize in order to prepare for that end state mission of possibly deployment. You know, I emphasize to my competitors that, you know, hard work is always going to beat talent, especially when talent doesn't work hard. So having a competition like that kind of brings out that fire back out of these, you know, individuals that have done some sort of training prior to their enlistment or, you know, even during and current in their enlistment. And you can never take away anybody who puts forth the effort and steps on those mats and competes in a tournament. Win or lose, every soldier that competes in any type of combative tournament are learning from that experience and they're adapting to it, they're building confidence, and that's the overall goal. Uh, in the combatives program is to build a soldier's self-confidence so that they're not experiencing these things for the first time in the real world or downrange. And the best thing that I want to happen out of this tournament is to get vast participation from all the competitors that want to compete and having ultimate support from higher echelons across this installation to come out, watch these soldiers display the fruits of their labor and their skill sets for everybody to see that they have these skill sets within their ranks. Now, every soldier should have the confidence knowing that they can put down their primary weapon system and utilize hand-to-hand -hand combat in the event of CQB and still get the mission done.